If you've been anywhere near TikTok recently, you've likely seen this question. How often do you think about the Roman Empire? Josh, how often do you think about the Roman Empire? Not every day, but it does come up every once in a while. Really? Yeah. Anthony, I mean... once a day. Really? Yeah. You're lying. I have a picture of the Colosseum in my house. So I... <laughs> <laughs> I'm Italian. Do you, do you think of the Roman Empire a lot? No. Okay, so this is- this I've got is, other stuff going on. This dude. is a hot topic <laughs> trend right now. And yeah. what do you guys think? Why Why is it? Like, why is the Roman Empire something that's even being talked about right now? No idea. <laughs> well, it's one of those questions that it's just like, it just, it's being posed to both genders to, or both people, you know, uh, just to see what people's thoughts are, right? Where with men and people who are very business oriented, a lot of the time, it's the idea of conquering. And the, the Roman Empire was the height of civilization and then it crumbled. See, now, right? now what they're saying is if you are a man that thinks about it once a day or all the time, then you are not conquering enough in your life. So you go back to a time in which you feel you, men, men were just born conquering the world. Is this valid or is this just come on? I so, feel like we're all making up different reasons. Why I, 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 this I, I, is this trending. is just well, what's I, trending. This is what's trending. trending. So it's what's, it's what's trending. So we're both realtors. Every day I'm conquering and building my business. So I think I'm trying to conquer a lot of stuff. So well, I might I might agree with that. But a your goals bit. get bigger every single day. They do. So. And you know what I loved about the Roman Empire was the architecture. I'm like, look at how, like, isn't the Colosseum beautiful? Like, how do you not think that's beautiful? And that's it was beautiful. part of the Roman Empire. I don't that's know. Pretty. They still haven't fixed it though. It kind of fell down a little bit. Do you guys think people just exaggerate their answers for this trend? Absolutely. 100%. Yeah. That's For how things sure. become trends. Yeah. Okay, so does it have anything to do though with the age gap? I mean, okay, so I think, you know, my generation, where if if this is true, we're all pretty, you know, we're we're pretty struggling with our mental health generation, my gen, right? 20, 25. If we think about the Roman Empire a lot, does that say anything about our character at all? Us as us as young men. Your character? Yeah, yeah. who we are as people. I think that'd be reading into it a little yeah. too much. Yeah, I wouldn't. I think I think there the fact that we all kind of gave different answers just is your answer in general, and the fact that there are different answers as to why people would think about it. But so right. to put a generalization on it, it's kind of a tough thing to do. It's just like saying you're a bad person for liking lattes versus cappuccino. <laughs> yeah. like, so what? why is the, why is the era so obsessive? I made the you know the the very large statement of saying, oh well, it was because men were conquering back then and, and they, they feel maybe they lose that now. Well, okay, if you want to look into any part of history, any part of history that you want to dig into can be interesting enough. Yeah. It just hasn't been the one that happened to be trending right now. Why would, this yeah. era? Why not? Maybe it's just what's, maybe, maybe it's just what's- the next one is the bubonic plague or something, or the dark uh, ages. Yeah. Or... Well, but, but why, why not, why not talk? I'd, I would rather talk about ancient Rome than talk about anything else. I would rather talk about history than talk about sports. So as, the fact that aliens? people are thinking of ancient Rome, see, maybe mine comes from the fact as I walk by the picture every day and I go, man, they don't build them like they used to. <laughs> <laughs> they yeah. don't build homes like they They don't build to, homes right? like that anymore. Okay, yeah. so let me ask you guys this. So we're talking about the male side, Trinity. I'm gonna throw it to you. Is there a female equivalent? What do you At think all? about every day? Like anything that comes to mind in, in history? <laughs> <No>. <laughs> there was one, um, apparently women um, on TikTok, this is what they're saying, women think about certain shows. Uh -huh. Because they, I, I do feel like though there is something to be said about uh, people putting themselves in those situations. Do you know what I mean? Like, uh, like, okay, one is, you know, I'm in elementary school and I'm thinking about, um, I think about, okay, well, if somebody comes in here in the classroom with a gun, how am I going to be the guy that saves the day? You cannot tell me you haven't thought about okay, that. Okay, fine, yeah, we have. You have? Yeah, we all have. Why, I probably have okay, why so do you put yourself in those situations? Because we want to be the hero. The yeah. struggle between good and evil. It's every story. It's the most classic story in the world. The, the, the struggle and defeating good, defeating evil. Okay. I, I want to add to the woman thing, though, Go quickly. Go. Is it The Bachelor? <laughs> Because I know it's The Bachelor. Every friend that I, think I have, a witch that is a woman. No, every friend that I have that's a woman is The Bachelor, and they're like, I would have done this, or I would have told them to take a hike. I'm I like, you not, can't tell them to take I a hike. Not He's watch the host. The Bachelor. I can't help you there. Every, but if people yeah. put themselves in those situations, they want to be in that situation. Huh. I will admit this. When I was thinking about, you know, somebody comes into the classroom with a gun, I want to be the savior of the day, be the hero. There was a point in my life when I was thinking about that. It was early grade nine and 10 for me. So, you know, a year ago <laughs> when, when I was thinking that and I was like, maybe I was at a low point in my life where I put myself in those situations to feel better about myself. Is there any merit to that? Possibly. I, mean, not, I don't know you're, why you're, I'm trying to fight Really, Really, you're the only one that can answer that. Yeah. Right? I feel like okay. there is. Do you want to be an emperor in ancient Rome? Uh, I think it'd be great. I, I would love to be who, fed grapes. Who wouldn't want to be the emperor of ancient Rome? <laughs> who do you have to answer to? 
We're conquering this country. Yes, sir. Great. I will say this. See you on Sunday. I think it says something. <laughs> I think it says something about men and women when they put themselves in situations that make them feel better about themselves. But anyways, we'll leave it there. On to the next. That's all we've got time for. We'll be right back with another trendy topic. Let's see if you guys are engaged in this one. I'm gonna rule the world. I'm gonna rule the world. Yeah.